Oh, should we do like the 1990s MTV thing? Like, welcome yes, to my crib. Yes, I'm home. Yo, what up, guys? Welcome to the Plymouth Coffee Bean. Let me show you around. What's up, cuties? We got a big day ahead. Um, got some things to do. But before I do that, I'm going to do my first entry in the high performance planner I got from Brendan Burchard. And before I do that, I think I need to make this thing my own. Let's find the thing I'm looking for. All right, got some stickers. This is what I'm looking for right here. Got that one. I don't need any more of those. We'll use this one and this one. Got some stickers. Let's throw these guys on. So when you eat, sleep, work, and hang out, make music, a plethora of other things, all in one 9 foot by 12 foot room, things get a little crazy. So the next task for today is to tackle this. Now the room is clean ish. It's kind of clean. It's a little clean. Somewhat clean. That's still kind of a mess, but hey. Personally, one of my biggest issues that I have in life um, is my ability to procrastinate. I was supposed to have this uh, funnel, which is uh, like a website, but it, you know it's just to sell my um, my photography services. But I was supposed to have it done like a long time ago, and I just put it off for a very long time. So now it is time to buckle down and get it done. So I'm working on the funnel, and there's a few things I need to work out. So I guess I'm not going to finish it today, but I did get some good work done for it. Um, and next is work on my amps. So let's go do that. This amp literally weighs like 80 pounds, so this thing's a beast, so I'm trying to get some wheels on it, um, so I don't die every time I need to move it somewhere, um, but the spring reverb tank was in the way, so I popped it out, I'm going to put these wheels in, and then hopefully the spring reverb tank will go back in, but if not, I will just pop it out, and I will keep it safe, because I would eventually probably want to put it back in, but I don't really use it, so... Yeah, um, you can just fast forward the video if you don't care about any of this, but uh, I thought it was cool, so I'm putting it in here, and it's part of my day, so deal with it, and listen to me, and just don't be a goon. Here comes the first, just marked out the hole. Here comes the first drill. The amp has wheels now. Uh oh. Have we already reached the point of the video where Keegan talks and videos play over it? 
Yes, we have. This right here is the Plymouth Coffee Bean. Uh, the coffee bean is sweet. I'll tell a little story about the coffee bean. I went there with Ryan Scott Graham. This guy, I was in like sixth or seventh grade, and I prepared a cover, a Mumford and Sons cover, and I showed up, and uh, I was told that you cannot perform covers there. So that week, I went home as one does, and I wrote two songs. Now, were they good? Absolutely not. But that's not the point. The point is, I took some action. All right, I went home, and I wrote two songs, and I came back, and I performed them. Here is a snippet from one of them. pretty spicy. I told you, this channel's all about transparency, baby. I've pretty much been performing at the Coffee Bean, I mean, ever since. Um, you know, I did more open mics. Um, I, uh, the first, the first EP that I ever wrote and recorded was released at the Coffee Bean. Um, I think it was like three years ago. And yeah, I've played multiple shows there. I've played open mics there and I even played the open mic yesterday. I'm sitting here editing this and I'm getting a little in my feels because I really 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 love that place um I've been absolutely blessed to have a creative space like that in my life I go there to get my work done I go there to make music I go there to hang out with people it's you know I've, I've you know had really tough talks with friends there I've had really amazing talks with friends there and so this is just my little appreciation uh post for um the Plymouth Coffee Bean. If you have a like creative space that you like going to, um, let me know what it is because I love trying out new coffee shops and uh, and just going different places. So uh, let me know where your creative space is and uh, I'd love to go check it out. But I'm going to end this video like this, a little sappy, but I love the Plymouth Coffee Bean. What can I say? Peace out. Much love. <laughs> is this a picture? What's going on? It's a video. <laughs> Is this way on YouTube? <laughs> Yo, uh, big ups. <laughs>